Hello everyone and welcome to my first Glitter Bells video. I am very excited about this. Um, some of you may have watched me before on my channel but I will also be creating videos for the Glitter Bells channel which is so exciting. So this is a video that I filmed quite a long time ago um, before all the lockdown and all the rest of it so I am not doing clients at the minute so this is an old video but anyway I'm just starting off on this pinky finger with your mint from glitter bells which is one of the relatively new powders that came out a couple of months ago and I'm just building up this nail uh, this was the first time I'd used this colour, so it was new to me, so I was using it um, very carefully because I didn't know how to work with this particular colour, but I get the hang of it as the video goes on. So I'm just using small wet beads at this stage and just building the colour up. I'm using my Glitter Bells number 12 rose gold brush which is my favorite and this is a redesign on this client so i have filed down her old set with my saiyan k38 which also came from the nails by annabelle website and then infilled with glass slippers and then started my design on top so this is a really, really easy design. Anyone could do this, so definitely give it a go. The thumb, the index and the pinky are all the same. They're all just plain your mint, which is the most stunning color. It is just beautiful. It is like a paler version of Tiffany Teal. It's just gorgeous. Sorry if you can hear any background noise, there is a, well there is somebody um, mowing their lawn, not so far away. <laughs> so with this one, I'm putting the colour at the top near the cuticle and pulling it down so it fades in the middle and then I'm going to come in at the bottom, well it's my bottom anyway, that's how I see it, and I'm pulling it upwards but I'm leaving the middle area as product free as possible and you will see why. So I only want the colour at the top and the bottom at this point. And then I'm coming in with Rainbow Crush. Surely that's what it's called. <laughs> it did say at the beginning of the video. Um, <clears throat> it's been so long since I've used any of these products, I'm forgetting the names. Um, so this is Broken Gold, which is just clear acrylic with shards of gold. And it is just per it's just amazing. So much easier than fiddling with um, gold leaf and stuff like that. So I just placed that Rainbow Crush in the middle, diagonally. And then I am outlining it with the Broken Gold. And I'm going to do exactly the same. Sorry, my voice is all funny. <clears throat> I'm going to do exactly the same on this finger. Again, try not to get much product in the middle because I don't want it to be too bulky. So keeping the bulk of the product at the tip and the cuticle area. And then coming in with that rainbow crush again, nice and thin, you only need a very small amount. It is literally stunning though. I've never seen a glitter like this, ever. And then coming in with that broken gold again and just outlining where I've put the rainbow crush. Thank you. 
so that is the design done um i did cap off camera for this set which i'm sorry about i will do some more capping videos but i'm now coming in with my glitter bells no wipe top coat and i am top coating all of these nails look how beautiful they are oh love them um yeah i'm also using my glitter bells um rubber gloves as you can see which are an absolute necessity at the minute and this is the finished design oh they're so pretty i just love them <laughs> i miss nails anyway it's so lovely to see you over on this channel and definitely subscribe and like my video and i'll be seeing you over on the glitter bells channel again very shortly so bye